have another question. I'd like to ask this question. If Islam is a religion of peace and tolerance, why is it that you have no democracy anywhere except where it's been imposed by the West? And can you please tell me one Muslim country that will give Christians and Jews the rights you have in Australia, in Britain, in Europe, in America, or even in Israel? Show me one. If you're a religion of peace and tolerance, can you please explain to me? I'm only asking the question, why is there 2.3 million dead Christians in Sudan? Why were 300,000 Christians massacred by the Muslims in East Timor? Why, please, are there 65,000 dead in the southern Philippines? Why 30,000 or so murdered in the Moluccan Islands? Why 40 to 50,000 murdered in Eritrea? Why 60,000 murdered in northern Nigeria, etc.? Why, if it is a religion based on peace and tolerance, were there thousands of people behaving like barbarians rioting in the streets of London, England, demanding the murder of a British citizen, himself a Muslim, for writing a book? Can you please answer? I'm only asking the question. If you're a religion of peace and tolerance, where does peace and tolerance exist in the Muslim world today? I only want to know. You're telling me it's a religion of peace and tolerance? I've heard that and heard that and heard that, but all I've seen on the news is suicide attacks. I'm tired of hearing. Please show me. I just want to see it. It's reasonable. Why is there three times as many conflicts in today's world involving Islam as all the other religious people groups put together? Why? Why in one, one country in Europe like Denmark, 4% of the population are Muslims, but 40% of the people on the dole are Muslims, and the overwhelming majority of convicted rapists are Muslims, while their victims are overwhelmingly Danish? That's just one example. Why was Theo van Gogh murdered for making a film about human rights in the Muslim world in Amsterdam? Why? Can you please explain to me, if you are a religion of peace and tolerance, why? Now, I'm told this is a small minority. Fine, if it's a small minority, please show me mainstream Islam. Show me one country that is democratic in your world, show me one country that will give me the freedom as a Christian that we give you in America, Britain, and Australia. Just show me one. Fair question. I'm not attacking. I'm asking the question.
Hello, and thank you for watching Morial TV. There are so many things that are happening at Morial Ministries worldwide, from the Philippines to Japan, to India to Africa, and back to Europe and the United States. So many of our brothers and sisters are spreading the good news of Jesus Christ to this lost world. We are so thankful for your prayers. God has been faithful and has blessed us in so many ways. If you'd like to partner with our efforts abroad and at home, please take a moment to click the link in the description and help us as the Lord leads you. Thank you very much and God bless.